Hey, Alberto. This new armor of yours is flimsy. More fit for a beetle than people. Yeah, way too thin. Felixstein! Peter shows a great protection. This is top craftsmanship, made from the finest quality materials. Built from... Uh, uh. Uh-oh, I can almost see the steam pouring from his ears. Look out, he's gonna blow. <laughs> titanium. We reinforce the armor with titanium we pulled from the scrapyard. That's why they're lighter and better protection. You guys shouldn't be such dicks. Well, why didn't he just say so? We'll see. <coughs> Thanks, Vincenzo. You didn't have to. It was nothing, Dad. Ah. As for you, those two oafs took the last titanium vests. No, I'm not here for armor. Sophie sent me. You're supposed to bring me in on some plan? The plan? My plan? Carl agreed? Carl agreed! You hear that, Vincenzo? Not Carl. Sophie. You gonna share or do I have to guess? Windmill. We take down the windmill. Bingo! The big windmill that provides power to the PK headquarters. <laughs> but first, we need the charges that Jack and Joe left at the water tower. Hm? Would you bring them to us, Pilgrim? After we blow it up, all the UV lamps in the PK headquarters will go out. That'll allow the infected to attack them. Hmm? Old Villador will be free again. And you, you have a clear route to, uh, uh, you know, the past chemical fallout and to, uh, uh, what's it called? The central loop. The central loop, right. How do you know the PK will withdraw and not retaliate? Because Dad designed this windmill. He knows it like the back of his hand. And it's the PK base's only power source. Without it, the PKs won't last another night in Old Villador. But we must act fast before the peacekeepers catch wind of our plans. So, you win? Okay, so... The windmill powers all the PK's UV lamps? Yes, it does indeed. A lot of people will die. Only if the PK don't turn tail and head back to where they belong. They stole that windmill from us. It was ours. Lucas and his men, they... When they came, they... Ah! Ah! Damn it! Took, took it. it. Exactly. They took it. Without electricity, Ator can't keep anyone here. We have generators, smaller power sources. They need a large power source. They'll have to withdraw. And before they return with backup from the central loop, we'll block the tunnel ourselves. Their commander, Jack Matt, is not going to risk fighting in the dark with the infected and renegades at his back. Old Villador will be ours again. And you will go to the center. All right, fine. I'll do it. Okay. Go to the water tower. We're going to use the charges that Jack and Joe tried to blow it up with. Let me know once you get there. We we'll finally put our plan into action.
shit. What happened here? What's going on here? PKs. They've been searching us for weapons. Found our Molotovs and went apeshit. Slaughtering everyone in sight. Looks like someone set us up. Who? And where are the bombs for Alberto? We managed to send some out. The couriers last reported near Star Square. Then silence. Alberto? The charges are gone. I'm going to the Star Square. That was their last check-in. Oh. Oh, my. Exactly. Ada? Yeah. Be careful. Someone sold us out. Find the, the, the charges. Without them, the plan cannot proceed. Doing what I can. I'll be in touch. The PKs ambushed your transport? They searched everyone and everything. Eventually they found the bomb. Someone tipped them off. And they took everything? Dunno. Suddenly something scared them off. And what? Where are the charges? Hey! Um, they were in the yard. Come on, maybe I didn't steal all of them. Lucky few of the infected showed up. Everyone scattered, probably leaving the bombs behind. Don't know why they didn't steal them. They were right under their noses. Morons. <laughs> Fucking hell.
Alberto, I have the charges. Wonderful! Excellent! So what are you waiting for? Come back! Here I come. Where's your father? There you are! Only two? The PKs took the rest. Damn, damn it, triple damn! Because of that traitor, our plan is in danger! We must act quickly! No, nitrates. We need fertilizer, then we can make more explosives. The old night runners, they've got everything. And certainly all we'll need to make more bombs. I know a guy lives on a rooftop. Friend, a foe, it depends. Killian, you know him? But Hakon's friend, Killian? Yes, Killian. I'll explain how to... How to... Uh, uh, I know the way, thanks. Still here. Are you crazy? Get it to kill him. You were supposed to be discreet, not go shouting in the middle of the bazaar. They surprised me. How was I supposed to know Mm. 
You there? Killian! 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 It's Aiden! There's Hakon. Back then, everyone must have thought BFFs forever. Bingo. Alberto, I have your fertilizer. It's Vincenzo. Vincenzo? I, I can barely hear you. The PKs, they raided my place. I can't talk. The traitor, he sold us all out. Hayden, Dad, went ahead to the windmill. Meet him there. I'll meet you when I can. Make sure that fertilizer gets to my dad. Okay, I'll do my best. Just come quick. Exactly what I'm afraid of. I'll stay with you on the radio. Hello? Vincenzo? Hello? Vincenzo, I I can't hear you. What? What do I have to do? I brought the fertilizer. Are you sure you got this? Of course I'm sure. And if I don't know something, I can ask Vincenzo. Ah, the windmill's causing too much interference. The radio doesn't work. Ah. Then I'll figure it out myself. It's as easy as I. And you're certain? He explained everything to me. Relax. We'll do... Me and you will do... <laughs> no reason we won't do just... And Fine. Like I said, easy as pie. The bombs are ready. You're up. Take the charges and secure them to the spots Vincenzo marked for us. Planting bombs. Oh, what could go wrong? Easy as pie, right? Yes, precisely. Like I said, easy as pie. The bombs are ready. to see the plan through 
to the end.
Too late to run now. Explosives are in place. Time for the fireworks. Would you like the honors? Sure. This should be fun. Mm -hmm. That isn't triggering. Must be interference from the windmill. That doesn't look like that did much. The windmill's still standing. I mean, the rotor's still spinning. Uh, Vincenzo's calculations. They must be off. Have it fixed in a flash. Gotta see this through. It's my fault. What are you doing? An armed bomb? Before the PKs get here. Giving you an armed... Um, uh, armed... We can't rely on radio detonation. Not with all the interference. What now? This one is guaranteed to blow up the whole windmill. All right, how much time do I have? Let me count. Hmm. It'll blow any second. Run! But where am I supposed to put it? Where? You have to go back. A and? And plant it on... Uh, place it on... Put it on... The Right in the middle of the windmill? I can finish my own sentences! Thank you very much! Planet, planet where? On the generator? No! Not there! On the rota! You have to climb up to the rota! To the very top? You serious? The bomb's ticking, Aiden. You really think we have time for jokes? Faster! Go on!
Hello? Hey, Alberto? Hey, Doc! Hey, guys! I'm coming! You sons of bitches! What have you done to him? When, when I think boom. No, that's what I call a boom. <laughs> I got my boom. <laughs> you, you, you got them. Pretty good. Huh? And we, we got him good. Without you, the windmill would still be standing. Almost like the fireworks in 90. Uh, 90. Uh, even. Ah, oh, man. I'm old. And you'll just keep getting older. Quit. The bullshit, Aiden. I'm not that adult. <sighs> Thanks for helping me. <laughs> I know what they think of me. Of course I know. <laughs> Tell everyone. We pulled this off thanks to Vincenzo. Okay. <laughs> That's thanks to you, Alberto. No. Thanks to Vincenzo, okay? They laugh at him. Laugh because of me. <laughs> but now that we've done this, they won't laugh anymore. See? His, his old man's, huh? Not a cook or a, or a failure anymore. <laughs> Force the peacekeepers to withdraw. Say it was him. Promise me. All right. Okay. Oh, and tell him. Tell him. That... That's okay. I'll tell him. That I'm proud. Never told him that. Son, I'm proud of you. I'll tell him for you. I promise. show you put on. Now it's time to blow this popsicle stand. I can't. One thing I still have to take care of. You don't get it. There's no time to waste. We can make our way to the center now. Everyone's too busy to notice. I promised Alberto I'd tell his son something for him. Do you want to finish your business or play shepherd spreading the good word? Well, it's bad news, Hakan. Alberto is dead. I see. But the metro is empty. There might never be another chance like this. Are you sure? I have to go find Vincenzo, Hakon. I promised. A night fucking errand. Hurry! Remember Sarah and Yana. Find me at their place when you're done. If you're still alive. Ugh! 
the supply after my shift. This uniform's too tight. I'd call that a wrap. All cleaned up. Didn't put up much of a fight. Yeah, because they're cowards. Told you before. What about the prisoners? Throw them in the dungeon? Unless you feel like banging them first. Look. It's Chubbs. They killed Chubbs? Looks like it. But only him, I think. We gotta tell Anderson. Yeah, but where is she? Should have been here ages ago. I'll look for her. I'm in the mood for a fight. It was over, man. I can't believe Carl betrayed us. Fuck, Pilgrim. At first I thought you gave us up. But Carl... If it wasn't for him, the Peacekeepers wouldn't have attacked. But he fled right after the blast. There are more on the upper level. Okay, I'll go there. You run. Don't be scared. It's safe now. Thank you. Hey, Sophie. So where's Vincenzo? Aiden, watch out! Aiden's gonna pay me hella gold for you! Cut! Shit! <laughs> Guy wasn't even worth a golden shower. Get up, Aiden. Thanks, man. That makes us even. It's not over yet. Aiden! Aiden! Come on, you coward! Ooh. Come down and fight! You better get out of here, Anderson. You're on bizarre turf. Look, tell Aiden there's still time to call this off. Why would he do that? We're winning. You're stupider than I thought. Come down and fight, and stop using your bizarre buddies as human shields. Aiden, no! Something's wrong. There you go. I'm gonna cut your throat. 
Aiden, we have reports that Aider's men are retreating. The plan worked. We took out their lights and the infected tore them to pieces. They don't stand a chance without him. Aider withdrew his men. They're in the metro tunnels. We're not getting to the center that way. Carl betrayed us. He's the one who went to the peacekeepers and warned them. Claimed he wanted to prevent bloodshed, but made things worse. But now, I run the bazaar. And I promise, we will defeat Ador. And I will take you to the central loop. Sophie runs the bazaar! For Sophie! <laughs> they know how many PK creeps it takes to screw in a light bulb? None! Because they're too dead to screw anything! <laughs> Alberto's dead. <laughs> Don't be a buzzkill, Aiden. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm serious. He was killed taking down the windmill. How'd it happen? We put Vincenzo's plan into motion, but then... Alberto had to go in his son's place. Sacrificed himself to blow up the windmill. Fuck me. To Alberto! <laughs> to Alberto! So... Where's Vincenzo? He's outside. Look around. Vincenzo. <laughs> we did it, Aiden. My dad, he really did it. Your father wanted me to tell you, um, he's always been proud of you. Very proud. What? Why are you telling me this and not him? He died, Vincenzo. Died for the bazaar. Was he in pain when he died? No, he was all smiles because of you and because he was able to carry out your plan. Thanks for being there with him, Aiden. Your dad kicked ass, Vincenzo. Yeah, Alberto's all right. Hell of a craftsman. For a loser, you mean. For a failure. That's what you used to say. If only we had more like Alberto, the PKs would have been gone ages ago. You... Go in and check on Vincenzo. Now! You did a freaking awesome job, Aiden. We'll beat the PK and we'll help you get to the center. You're one of us now, brother. You're part of the Bazaar family. Thanks, Barney. Good luck. Good luck, Pilgrim. Hey, Hakon. Where are you? I'm waiting for you at the girl's place. You'd better hurry, Aiden. The passage to the center. It's blocked. I have another idea. Just come quickly. Time is not on our side. Okay. I'm coming. Back on. Ah, you're finally here. Let's go. When Yana heard you were coming, she grabbed Sarah and they left. Seems they weren't too fond of you. Hey, where are we uh... at? <laughs> ah, Waltz! Fucking hell! Ah. Calm down, just let me see. Let me see, ah, I'll help. Fuck! Wait! I'll help, ah. show me. Relax, you're gonna pull through. What's that? 
The wound from the Lazarus? If so, you killed Lucas. If not for those brass knuckles, it would only took a few seconds to do the job. Ah, I thought he was a better fighter. Ah! The fuck are you saying? Ah, no point denying it with this wound, right? So you carved out his tattoo and planted it on Barney. Ah, Waltz, he ordered the kill. You're working with Waltz and you didn't tell me? You piece of shit. Oh, you don't get it, kid. Waltz would have killed me, you see, like he killed Dylan. And anyone who defies him. I have to get out of here, get it? I couldn't have told you. Why? You know he's the one who tortured me in the past. I didn't tell you in order to protect you. So what if you find out something about, about your sister? Waltz will kill you. Where is he? Ah, fuck. Where is Waltz? Yes. Supposed to meet him under the electric car factory in the GRE tunnel. Hey, then I'm fucking dead here, understand? They're gonna kill me. You'd leave me. You'd leave me now. I should leave you to die for what you did. Why wouldn't you? I'm gonna find that sniper first. Ah. <sighs> really? You do that for me? A life for a life. After that, we're fucking done. You see that goddamn sniper? No, nothing. Use your binoculars. Shut up. I'm done listening to your sage advice. I know, I fucked up. Let's leave it at that. Those bolts fly far and fast. Find something to hide behind. Tell me something I don't already know, Hakon. I got eyes, Hakon. Aiden, you all right? Yep, I'm fine. Clever fucker. Shut the tanks. Aiden, you all right? Yep, I'm fine. Clever fucker. Shut the tanks. I'm a shit duck. Run, boy! Run! Man, that prick's got an eagle eye. I see him, Aiden. He's sticking to the roof. Stop!
Shit, he dropped the ladder. Well, so much for surprise. We figure something out. Still in one piece? <clears throat> for now, yes. I gotta get behind him somehow. like that. Who else wants to kill you, Hakon? Ader? The, uh, the PKs? I lost track ages ago. better. Why are you hunting Hakon? Uh, is this about the killing Lucas, sir? Tell Hakon that it's not over wait. yet. Hey, 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 wait, hey, hey, wait, 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 ah. wait, ah. Hakon, you still alive? My meter's still running. Akon, yeah, she got away. But you're safe. For now. She? There's a woman. Fuck. Yeah? And I don't think she likes you. That sounded personal. Personal, huh? Doesn't usually narrow it down. But I know who it is. Watch out for her, Eden. She's one of the most dangerous people you'll ever meet. And yeah, noted. Now I'm going to the central loop. Beware of Waltz, Eden. Renegades have appeared all over the center, and he's working with them. He's looking for the key you've got. I'm done listening to your advice. Sophie, I'm gonna need your help getting to the center. The guy who was supposed to get me there, he... Well, things got complicated. Ader's men are still fighting. They barricaded themselves inside the tunnel. I can't help you. What about our agreement? Relax. Listen. There's another way through. An old tunnel under the hills near the Tango Motel. It was used by smugglers. Peacekeepers didn't even know about it. It's been closed for years. But if you manage to start the generators, you might be able to get to the center. And <laughs> you're telling me this just now. Sorry, Aiden. I want to help you. But most of all, I had to help the bazaar. Good luck, Pilgrim. Nobody? Ever again? That sounds a bit extreme. Well, you think so? What do you think is the first step in loving yourself? You seem to know the answer. Why don't you tell me? Flowers. Flowers? Precisely. Nowadays, I'm hanging around near the metro station in considerable safety and all. But before I joined the PKs, I used to live down in Trinity. I had a shop there, the Blooming Tulip, near the bazaar when it was still the Church of the Holy Trinity. I was raised in an orphanage among a multitude of apathetic people. <laughs> Maybe that's why I turned to flowers. But after the outbreak, people stopped buying them. Well, that's understandable. Certainly, but uh, there was this old lady. I basically kept the store open just for her. She'd come every day, as if nothing had changed. 
Her visits were the highlight of my day, until one day she didn't show. What happened to her? Her flowers ate her alive. How should I know? I was growing these special pink roses for her. It was her last order, and I simply couldn't throw them all away. So I kept one of the roses and dried it, just for her. She'd be delighted to know that you never forgot her. Yeah. If only I could get that rose to her. Could you take it? She never said where she lived precisely, but I asked her once where she kept all her flowers. She said, in a beautiful house made of glass, where the old mound used to be. Here, take the rose. Please find the house and give it to her, if she's still there. A house made of glass reminds me of that flower lady. Hmm. Maybe I should check it out. Farewell, flower lady. So this is her story. I understand now why she went to his flower shop every day. Her son should know that he was loved. Yeah! <laughs> 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 
Gotta put that Carl Weasel through the ringer. Yeah, I found her. I'm afraid she... She had passed away. She was with her flowers. So... She died in peace. She did, yes. She wrote a letter and actually mentioned you. She did? Yes. Here. I think you should read it. This old lady was... My mother? So many times as a kid, I imagined how she'd look. I'd see other kids at the park with their mothers, and I'd have this knot in my stomach, feeling I could never see mine, knowing I could never hold her hand, thinking she never even cared, when in fact, she did care. I did see her every day for years. I never expected that she... <sighs> Maybe this is why I couldn't throw away her flowers. Thank you, Aiden. Love isn't dead after all. I'm, uh... I'm gonna need some time alone now. <sighs> Thank you for giving her the rose. I'll uh, see you around, Aiden. Locked. How to find another way. Aiden, you there? It, yeah, kind of. Bit busy. Just letting you know, we've detected movement among the PKs. They're looking for you. Take care, and good luck. The GRE tunnel. This could be the place Hakon talked about, but no sign of Waltz.
damn it. Well, maybe there's some kind of generator around here. Just what I needed. What's behind door number one? Aiden, you don't call, you don't write, and it was such a promising friendship. Waltz ordered Lucas's death. Detective Aiden won't rest until he solves the case. You expect me to believe you? Why would I? <laughs> because Waltz is here. Hang on. Boys, search the tunnel. And why would Waltz have Lucas killed? To weaken the PKs, to put a wedge between you, spread chaos. I don't know his plans. I fucking hate politics. <clears throat> and you picked the wrong side. What else is there to discuss? Aider! Aider! They're attacking the headquarters! Bizarians! They took the metro station! What the fuck? Come on, grab that door! This gun did it! Quiet! I warned you, Aider. <sighs> the electricity's off. We need to find the fuse box. What's going on here? Who turned it off? Who do you think? You're gonna be a smart ass now. <laughs> I'm just saying, let's get him. Hmm? Well, you can't escape anyway. Okay, search for the fuse box. There should be a utility room nearby. Pepper, check the other entrance. You two search that tunnel. It's a maze, but if Waltz is hiding here, he had to leave a trail like any slug. We're waiting, Aiden. <sighs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Pepper, do you have anything? There are some wires, but it's all flooded. This doesn't look good, Lieutenant. The equipment's been shut down for 15 years. Keep looking. Hopefully that's not the reason for the short circuit. Someone was here. They yanked out the cord. Okay, that was tough. Even for me. Who else could have come this way? <clears throat> Damn. Someone must have locked that door. Somebody's in here! It's him! Get him! You're gonna pay for Lucas. <laughs> Still on Jack Matt's leash? Save it for your trial, just before they cut your head off. Do you really think that's how this is going to play out, Lieutenant? Lucas's death was just the beginning. You admit you had him killed. Take him. Why does his death bother you? You're not enjoying your new role. New status, new challenges. New possibilities? Don't I deserve a thank you for making this possible? Nicely put. Now enough of your crap. Cuff him, Pepper. I'm glad you finally joined us. Shut up, Walt. Now, give back what you stole from me. Give back the key, boy. Or you will all die. Fuck! Pepper! What are you waiting for? Kill him! You've done! The little boy wants to pretend he's a grown-up, but he's no grown-up. Just a precious little boy. Something weird about him. Oh, fuck. 
Says the GRE key. This is it, Waltz. I'm coming for you. Ugh! <laughs> 
You? I already killed you once. This time, I'll do it right. You're one of my curious. Good. Before I kill you, you'll get a chance to witness something spectacular. Everything comes full circle. We return to the beginning. And now, you will witness history in the making. A history? Five years old! You thought you kids! We were kids! You were part of something greater. You owe it to me that you are still alive. That you are stronger than others, special. That you are stronger than I could have imagined. Yet not as strong as me. Any last words? What have you done to my sister? Sister? What have you done to Mia? Aiden, you're alive. Come on. Uh, wait, I gotta... I gotta take... What the fuck? Run! He's transforming!
Now talk. Who the fuck are you? I'm Aiden. And you? Why are you helping me? Show me your arm. Come on. I won't bite. Well, not hard. We have something in common. I was one of that crazy fucker's subjects, too. Hey, Mia, did you know a girl named Mia? Mia? No. Who's Mia? She's my sister. We were in a GRE place together. I have to find her. Well, if she's alive, she must be pouring herself for water somewhere in the city. What? Not that I'd blame her. What, what are you saying? Fuck you! Whoa, Gadjo. Sign of the times. The world we live in. Just saying. I have to find her. Well, first, let's fuck out of here. Not sure we managed to ditch that psycho. Hey, wait! Hell, she's fast. The entrance to the central loop's not far away. We'll be safe there. Waltz! The military, they're here! Bring them in. Away. Do you have nightmares about what he did to us? All the time. That's why I want to kill the fucker. Waltz is number three on my list. So, Waltz experimented on you? When? How long? When? It's blurry, the time I spent there. But I was a lucky one. Managed to run after a few weeks. I don't remember you. I'll take that as a compliment. Those who do don't usually have fond memories. Most prefer to forget me, if they survive. Yeah, but you ran. Sort of. What about the rest of the kids who were in the hospital? Oh man, someday someone will write a book about it. And it ain't gonna be a bedtime story. Most of them are gone. I ran across one guy, though. He'll sleep with a knife in his hand for the rest of his life. In the refrigerator, he converted into a shelter for himself. That he'll never leave. We didn't organize a therapy group, if that's what you're asking. Wait, you got a hit list? <laughs> Seriously? Do I look like I'm kidding? The city's got a lot of trash, and I'm the maid who's going to make it the capital of cleanliness. Uh, who else is on it? Besides Waltz, Butcher, Hakon, and you know what? It's a very long list. There's a few small fries that deserve a bolt between the eyes as well. And by whose authority are you doing this? <laughs> you kidding me? The highest court of justice in the land. My own noble authority, your honor. And you? What were you doing with that bastard Hakon? You'll have a hard time believing this, but he saved my life. When I came to town, I was infected, and yeah, no biomarker. People of the bazaar wanted to hang me. Sure, I'd do it myself. But he got me out of there, got me a biomarker. Can't believe he duped me. He dupes everyone, like everyone. I trusted him once too. Really? Tell me about it. Maybe someday, but my story's similar to yours. He tricked me, and people died. Better forget about him. Or do like me. When you see him next, make sure you have a crossbow and a bunch of bolts handy. Okay, enough chatting. Let's go. <laughs> Bossy. I like that. We gotta go. Yeah, I'm coming. Wow. I thought you were gone. <sighs> Apparently, Waltz was doing these experiments on the sly. Fucking 
psycho. But and no one in the GRE noticed? At some point they did. I heard that's why they kicked him out. Too bad it was too late. And Hakon, why is he on the list? Because he killed Lucas? No. I like those blue puppets, the PKs. But no, I don't give a shit about Lucas's death. And why then? That, my dear, is a long story for another day. Let's just say everyone on that list deserves a headshot, and Hakon deserves something worse. Fuck! This was always open. We're locked out. <sighs> Fucking great! This is a GRE facility, isn't it? Oh man, it worked! Where did you get that? You know Dylan? Dylan gave me this before he died. Waltz killed him. Fucking... So he got him after all. Also, Dylan told me to find someone named Luan. You know who that is? Maybe we were meant to meet each other. The universe brought us together for some fucked up reason. What? I am the one. Dylan wanted to contact Frank. He said the PK commander, Lucas, found something. Something Waltz had been looking for for a long time. He wanted to escape the city so that Waltz wouldn't get it. The GRE key? I have it now. <laughs> Probably. Lucas died because of this gizmo. Dylan, too. Watch out. Or you'll be next. It's valuable. For Waltz, invaluable, I suppose. So you'd better not lose it. Look out! Oh, what's going on? Impossible. Waltz must have switched on the generators. But Waltz? But why? Don't have a clue. Who knows what's in that fucker's head? Come on. Hurry, Ladies before they go off again. The train is delayed. The Metro service is sorry for any inconvenience. Please mind the gap. Thank you for your attention. You're fucking welcome. Hurry, Aiden. Seems we have a clear path to the central loop.